In this video, we will learn how to carry out correlation analysis in a situation when your data do not possess the properties of normal distribution. Let me remind you that there are two situations. In situation one, your data possesses the properties of normal distribution. In situation two, your data do not possess the properties of normal distribution. In first situation, when data possesses the properties of a normal distribution, we apply parametric test of correlation analysis. Whereas, in a situation when your data do not possess the properties of a normal distribution, then we apply non-parametric test of correlation analysis. Let me demonstrate in SPSS. You see here, we have four variables. Trust, reliability, and second pair is uh, shyness and moodiness. And we are interested to find out correlation analysis between trust and reliability and between shyness and moodiness. Let's first examine their normal distribution properties. So the go to analyze and then descriptive statistics, then descriptive. And then let me reset it. And here are those variables. Let me bring them here and then go to options here and check these two options kurtosis and skewness. So here we go. You see here kurtosis and skewness both in first pair mean the trust and reliability they are much above the minimum limit the maximum limit so you see here so that means basically these two variables do not possess the properties of normal distributions whereas the other two variables shyness and moodiness so skewness and cutoff values they are within the limit so that means so the second pair possesses the properties of normal distribution and the first pair do not possess the properties of normal distribution. So we will apply non-parametric test in the first pair and parametric test on the second pair. And how to do it? So go to menu bar, click analyze, then correlation, and so here you see so the first pair is trust and reliability. Let me bring them here. So the trust and reliability you see here. So they do not possess the properties of normal distribution. That means, so we will apply non-parametric test. So you, you see here, so we have three options. The third option is Spearman. Spearman is used in case when data do not possess the properties of normal distribution. So this is non-parametric test. So let's check it, this option and just click it. Okay. So here we go. So you see here, so this is the correlation coefficient. And uh, uh, so it is 0.267, so it is positive and it's highly significant also. As p value is much less than 0 0.001. So that means correlation between these two variables is positive and is statistically significant. Now let's go to the second pair that is shyness and moodiness. So, so since these two variables possess the properties of a normal distribution, so we will apply parameter test. So how? Let's go to analyze, then correlation, and then uh, let me bring the two variables here and check the option of the Pearson. Pearson is used for for parametric test. It is, it is used in parametric test of correlation. Just click it. Okay. So here we go. So here also uh, correlation is positive and is statistically significant. So this is how we carry out correlation analysis in case of parametric and non-parametric. 